A bookworm, in a literal sense, is widely considered to be a worm that bores through books, chewing on the paper, and damaging them. However, there is no literal bookworm. Instead, what we call bookworms are the larvae of any number of insect species, including beetles and moths. These larvae can resemble worms, and though they do sometimes chew through the paper, they usually prefer the cloth binding of old books or the glue used in binding them. Other times, it's the mature insects themselves, such as termites, that damage books. There are also insects called book lice or paper lice, not true lice, that are often found in old books, where they are attracted to mold and other organic matter. Regardless of whether a bookworm exists in nature, it is the inspiration for this idiom. Meaning of the English idiom bookworm. A bookworm is a person who reads a lot, one who loves books and spends a lot of time reading and studying. Usage of idiom. This idiom can tend to be a bit derogative as being a bookworm is considered having an unusual affection for books and learning. However, it can just as well be neutral or positive. Someone who loves books will probably not call another person a bookworm, and if they do, it'll be in a positive way as a kindred spirit. A bookworm should not necessarily be confused with a bibliophile, which is someone who loves books but not just for reading, but for their history, format, etc. A bibliophile is usually a collector of books, while a bookworm just loves to read. Examples of use. I've always been a bookworm and I still prefer a paper book to digital, but I can't deny the convenience and instant gratification of digital books. Alan is such a bookworm. Don't you think it would be good for him to get out and play with other kids? Teresa's a true bookworm. She spends all her time studying and she reads voraciously. Sometimes she's reading three books at once. I used to visit a little bookstore where I traded in sackfuls of paperbacks for new books. The lady who owned the store loved that such a young boy was such a bookworm. She sometimes gave me two books in exchange for one. Origin of Idiom This idiom, which uses the notion of an actual bookworm as a metaphor for a keen reader, has been used since at least the mid-1700s. Samuel Johnson's Dictionary of the English Language in 1755 defines an actual bookworm as a worm or mite that eats holes in books, chiefly when damp. And it defines the idiom bookworm as a student too closely given to books, a reader without judgment. I hope this video helped. If so, I could use your help. Could you give it a thumbs up and if you have time, leave a comment below? And if you want more new idiom videos like this one, subscribe and use the bell notification icon.